yo, 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 what's up? I am Arthur Bullock, a.k.a. Hothead. Today, peace to America and the whole wide world. It is Wednesday, May 31st, 2023. Good morning. What is going on? Welcome to Autism Speaks. Today, on Autism Speaks, on the Autism Speaks podcast, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to talk about being a salesman on the autism spectrum. You know, I have been doing a bunch of stuff I've learned from different pitchmen, like Billy Mays, Anthony Sullivan, Vince Offer from the ShamWow commercials, and the Slap Chop commercials, and many more. You know, during March, I have been, you know, working on an OxyClean commercial. I've been shooting my OxyClean commercial at, uh, um, you know, probably here at the villa, St. Joseph's Villa in Richmond, you know, Today, it is, you know, the last day of May, I have turned 21 this month, you know, I am so excited for June tomorrow, you know, if you are one of the big fans of my podcast, Autism Speaks, and one of my OxyQueen commercials, you should listen to my message. To the guy Phil Swift from the Flex Seal commercials. You know, I have a big message that I want to say to Phil Swift from the Flex Seal commercials. You know, I want you to know Phil Swift is Swift. This is my message. Listen to my message. Don't knock me, Arthur Bullock, because I am coming after you. Remember, Swift, do not knock me off. Don't knock me, the autistic Arthur Bullock, off because I'm coming after you. If you're listening out there, you know what? It's over. I'm fed up. So fed up with all this. Sham pal, Phil Swift... I'm always coming after you. So what it's like for me to be a pitchman on the autism spectrum. It's like I have a million IQ to myself. You know, to me and myself. You know, last year and during 2021 or 2022, you know, I have been drawing some prototypes of some inventions that will be featured on television will be televised soon in the future, you know, I have been drawing concepts of different products, Mighty Putty Blue, you know, or the Smart Talk device used for cell phones, which is the successor or some kind of successor to one of Billy Mays, Anthony Sullivan's products they pitched, the Jupiter Jack, you know, the smart talk hands-free device for cell phones, you know, it's amazing, you know. I really want to make, you know, a product that's the equivalent to Phil Swift's latest product. It's called Mighty Super Glue, which is the equivalent to Flex Super Glue. That's what I want to make. That's what I want to do. Draw a prototype of Mighty Super Glue from the makers of Mighty Putty, Mighty Mendit, Mighty Shine, Mighty Green, or Mighty Putty Blue. That is what I want to do. That is what I want to do. You know, I don't want Swift, Billy, or Sully just to rip me off, you know, Vince Offer from the ShamWow commercials and the underground comedy movie, you know. He's been inventing, I mean, you know, he's been in one of the ShamWow and Slap Chop commercials. 
Billy Mays has been pitching the equivalent to Vince Products, you know, Zorbies, S O R B double E Z, Zorbies, and the Quick Chop, you know, some kind of food chopper that's the equivalent to the Slap Chop. Remember, I remember my first time, you know, two decades ago, I have been seeing Vince's Sham Wow commercial and the Slap Chop commercial back in the day when I was in elementary school, and I've been watching it over and over again when I got older, since I've been hitting puberty, since I've been in middle school, you know. I've been watching a bunch of Billy Mays commercials over and over again since middle school, and um, it's amazing, you know. I've been talking to my dad about wanting to be a salesman on the autism spectrum, you know, I really want to actually make a million a million dollars I'm gonna make a million dollars you know you know it ain't too late to make a million dollars you know I Arthur Bullock aka Hothead I will actually you know probably say I'd be shouting in their faces or the cameraman, Hi Arthur Bullock here for, I don't know what I'm selling yet, you know what I mean? I'm just probably, you know, writing scripts for my commercials, write a script, you know, for my commercials, about my products. The commercials I'm, you know, one of the scripts I'm writing for commercials, the commercials are about my products, you know. I'm always writing... All year long, I've been writing... Commercial or scripts for... You know, commercials... That are all about my products, you know. I have been, you know... Last year... I've been... You know, drawing prototypes of all these products that I'm going to sell in the future. And will soon be televised in the future once I get older and older. Before the next decade, I'm going to be in my 30s. You know, I have only about 14 months left here at the villa as of this month. And then by June, I will have only 13 months left. You know what I mean? I am so, so excited to be the best pitchman ever. I am going to be the first autistic pitchman to be televised. I'm going to be on TV. You know, all around America, all around the world, that is what's going to happen in the future. You know, after my post-secondary graduation at St. Joseph's Villa, you know what I mean? I am so, so excited to be rich. That means I'm going to make millions of money. That means I'm going to make million dollars. I'm going to be a millionaire. It's all about making millions of dollars. Selling products. To people on the autism spectrum. You know. I am taking after. The late Billy Mays. Anthony Sullivan. And Vince Offer the ShamWow guy. And. Phil Swift from the Flex Seal commercials. That is what I'm going to do. So. You know what. My podcast today is all about being a pitchman on the autism spectrum. 
you know, if you want to be a salesman like I do, even though if you have autism, you have to have enough IQ, you have to have enough brains in order for you and yourself to do that stuff like I do. Just be a pitchman. You gotta have the right ideas for the right product for you and yourself just to sell to a bunch of people around the world and around America. That is what we have to do. You know, I think I have enough brains to do that stuff, but like, being a pitchman, step by step. You know, you draw a prototype of a product, place, um, put a unique name to write for the product, and write a script for your commercial about the product you're going to sell. That is what we have to do. That's what I do all year long. Even though I've been finding some rare Billy Mays and Anthony Sullivan commercials on my YouTube channel. It's amazing. I found a Phone Free Anywhere commercial last month back in April. You know, during that Sunday last month in April, before I was at this age when I was 20, the previous age. You know, F O N E. F R double E phone free. You know, just before Billy Mays pitched to Jupiter Jack, you know, I've also been finding a rare Kaboom commercial from 2001 featuring Billy Mays. I know I have over like a thousand views. On the Kaboom commercial I found. That I have posted. Last year. You know. It was amazing. You know. So you know what. I am still being on a hunt for. Rare infomercials. Including Billy Mays and Anthony Sullivan commercials. So. I've explicitly done that last year. So, my goal is to find more commercials, even more commercials about every product from the past and pres present to future. Featuring Billy Mays and Anthony Sullivan. You know, Billy and Sully are great pitchmen. Just like anybody else. Like me. So, thank you so much, everybody, for listening to the Autism Speaks podcast. We want to make sure you enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. Enjoy the rest of your last day of May. Tomorrow is first day, the first day of June. And I hope you have a very great June. So... We hope y'all suck it, and probably have a great day. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Leave a like on this video. Leave a like on this podcast of mine. I'm Arthur Bullock, and this has been Autism Speaks. Thank you so much for tuning in. We'll be back next Wednesday. You know what I mean? Bye-bye.